In this video, I will show you how to create a Payoneer account. So let's jump straight into it. So in order to do this, what you're going to want to do is open up a new internet browser and come across to the official Payoneer website, which is payoneer.com. Now from the home page, if you look towards the top, you're going to see the register button up here. So what you want to do first is go ahead and click onto this. And what it's going to do is take you across to a screen like this. Now what you want to do is select the option for the type of Payoneer account that you need. So it is still down to personal preference and it would depend whether you want this because you're an e-commerce owner, freelancer, marketplace, service provider or a different kind of digital business. So what you would do is just go ahead and select your option from here. For the purpose of this tutorial, I'm just going to go ahead and select other digital business. Now what you need to do is tell Payoneer whether you're looking to both send and receive global payments or whether you're looking to set up an account to pay suppliers, contractors and other business partners but you don't actually need Payoneer to receive payments. So if you're looking to both send and receive payments you want to select this option but if you just want to send payments and not receive payments into Payoneer you want to go ahead and select this option. For the purpose of this tutorial I'm going to go ahead and select this one to send and receive global payments. So next you're going to be asked for your monthly volume, so in other words how much money is going to be transferred through Payoneer through sending and receiving money and you've got three different brackets here. For the purpose of this tutorial I'm just going to go ahead and select the middle bracket which is $10,000 to $20,000. So now it's going to go ahead and give you a summary of the type of accounts that you're going to get. So as you can see we're going to be able to get paid by clients all via marketplaces. What you can do is withdraw your earnings to your local bank at low rates, withdraw funds at ATMs and track and manage your international payments in one platform as well as pay your suppliers and subcontractors for completely free. So if you're happy with the right account that it's suggested for you, what you're going to want to do is press the register button here. And now all you need to do is go ahead and complete the sign up form. So it's going to ask you for your personal details as well as contact details. So you just want to go ahead and fill this in. So there is also a section you need to complete with your security details. So what you need to do here is enter your password and also you want to submit your ID. Now this is used for a verification. The ID type that's asked for does depend on your country. So for myself, I've got the option of a driving license, national ID and passport. So make sure you fill this in in order to continue. Otherwise you're not going to be able to go ahead and sign up. And on the final screen, it's going to ask for your bank details. Now this is just to go ahead and link your bank. So when you get paid on Payoneer, they have the bank details, which they will be able to go ahead and send your payments to. So you just want to go ahead and complete the screen here. Once that's done, make sure to agree to the terms and conditions and the pricing and fees and tick the box if you'd like to receive marketing communications. Once that's done, go ahead and press submit at the bottom. So once you've gone ahead and done that, what's going to happen is your application is going to be sent off to Payoneer to be reviewed and you just want to keep an eye on the email that you entered as they will be able to tell you when your account is live and you can log in. So once it's live, what you can do is just click come back to Payoneer.com, click on to sign in and then just go ahead and sign into your account with the details that you created. Now normally there's a two-step verification in place, so what you're going to want to do is go ahead and enter the code that will be sent to your mobile device. And once you've gone ahead and done that, that's going to take you across to your dashboard. So that is how to go ahead and create a Payoneer account. I hope this tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.